They've been building on this site for three years, but the buildings aren't finished. If they left it alone, we would have played here every day. Children digging. Children dig out stones from the ground to get building materials and sell them in commercial markets. This is a picture of something common in our houses, neighbourhoods and society. It is the problem of the demolition of homes which we were subjected to earlier on in the last war on the Gaza Strip. After this destruction of homes, people were unable to rebuild them. My mum didn't cook the macaroni in the oven because there was not enough gas. This is the first time I've hated macaroni because it wasn't baked. Children learn fighting from the war and so they fight among themselves using sharp tools. The children in schools are scared of the Israeli bombardment and the possibility of another war. The Cultural Free Thought Association is a community-based organization. So we work with children, teenagers, women. So what we, what we are focusing on is, first of all, the psychological support, the daily need of people, and to work also closely with, with families. So we, we are not working alone. Now, some of the children are uh, very traumatized from, from what they see. For example, one of the children might have a problem with um, uh, darkness or, uh, you know, uh, worrying or hyper or, uh, you know, uh, they don't concentrate. So depending on each case, you know, the, the educators help them to go to the right section and to use the uh, suitable method with them to, to help them. The people, the, our target group is like the neighborhood of, uh, of Khan Yunis camp, the different neighborhoods in, in Khan Yunis camp. We, sometimes we go to, to them to inform them about, uh, about the activities, but it's the only center in the camp, and the camp is crowded and there is no space for, for children to play. So the center gives them the space, you know, to come and, you know, just play and uh, jump and do stuff. Where there is no taboo or there is no forbidden. They can do whatever they want to do. If I'm looking at the future, I think I will just look at children and think that uh, and hope that if, you know, if, if we go right with our children, and we try to help them to, to come over the, all the violence they, they are seeing, which is very difficult, but we, we are trying to do it. I think it's, it's, it's the hope which, which will help, you know, or it's the only hope maybe.